Hi Cancer, welcome back to Omkara Taro and to your love bite. Let's see what message wants to show through for you today Cancer. And of course these are general collective readings, will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind, take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers, thank you for being here. And um, Cancer, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us, we welcome you in. All right, so Cancer. Mm -hmm. What on my deck? I have the Queen of Swords. Somebody's got their boundaries up now big time. Maybe they've cut off somebody who was... Well, things were not working out here, but uh, I do see a king of wands now in the upright. Somebody wants to offer a new beginning to this, somebody who they disrespected maybe in the past or they, you know, did offer a commitment or there was something that happened which uh, pissed this person off. But uh, now there is a new beginning coming, maybe somebody wants to reconcile. There's been a lot of heavy duty thinking about this, about why things didn't work out, why the stagnation happened, the lies that was told. But uh, let's see what happens then. I'm um, going to start uh, Cancer with um, some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be. Then we'll start the clarification here. So Cancer and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Cancer and their person. One more. Cancer and their person. Okay. Cancer and their person. Let's take a few more Cancer from another deck. Cancer and their person. If any of you are looking for personal readings, Cancer, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. Cancer and their person. Okay. All right. Good to go. Thank you. The first card here, Cancer says, It's really insulting when you try and control the situation and withhold information. You're underestimating my intuitive abilities, my connection with the divine and must be forgetting how connected we are on soul level. You know that I'll always know what's going on because even your higher self tells on you. I know you think you broke me, but don't give yourself so much credit. I'm not porcelain. I might have a few cracks, but I let the light in and allowed it to shine back into the world. Don't worry about fixing me so much as you should worry about fixing yourself. Somebody is really pissed off at the screen of so, uh, pentacles, I think. I'm an understanding person and I appreciate that although we are eternally connected, we need our own space. I can't understand why you're not able to communicate that you simply need some time to process things. Instead, you ignore me, knowing that it hurts me more and more every time. I want us to build trust and work on a foundation of friendship before we can have a romantic and sexual relationship. Your love makes my day, my week, my month, my year and my life. Not talking to you absolutely breaks my heart and soul into a billion shattered pieces. I want to reach out to you but I can't find the right words as I'm feeling so fragile right now. Yeah, I think somebody, like I said, somebody doesn't know what to say, you know. Okay, I'll wait for you as long as I have to. There is no one in the world as amazing as you. I didn't have the courage to tell you. All right, uh, Cancer, if these were resonating with your storyline, let's start your reading. I'm going to start with an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you first. A blessing, guidance, advice, or a message. Blessing, guidance. Why two together, spirit? 
just need one blessing guidance advice or a message peaceful that is a there is a possibility of a peaceful resolution to whatever's going on cancer but first i first and foremost peace to your own soul i think the angels are sending you a lot of peace lot of happiness just stay calm say just be open to the process of what's happening okay i know somebody is very upset and angry here uh queen of uh, pentacles in reverse spirit queen of pentacles in reverse yeah somebody has been delaying maybe this queen of pentacles always saw that person as the king of wands i mean they've shown up twice already here um maybe the chemistry was there the attraction was there this was seeming like a perfect person but i think this king of wands could have delayed offering commitment and then now the queen of pentacles is in reverse so what's the ace of pentacles now spirit ace of pentacles somebody now wants to work on this commitment they want to come and offer a stable brand new beginning they are ready to put in the work they want to have victory in this connection cancer they do want a reunion 3 of cups 3 of cups 3 of cups yeah they want to reunion definitely but they the reason they haven't come forward till now is because of this queen of swords who is our overall energy as well right somebody could have become a little bit upset and angry and maybe has boundaries up uh, this person is very stressed out about how to talk to the queen of swords now i mean look at the sword <laughs> look at the size of the sword of the queen uh, anybody would be scared right what if i go and they cut my head off kind of a thing so somebody is extremely stressed out about uh, now going forward and asking for a reconciliation or let's start again so hanged man i think this person is stuck right now yeah they want to move forward so bad and apologize they are enlightened to that fact at least that they do need to they need to be the one they need to come forward they need to apologize now their eyes are open now they've already seen things from maybe the queen of swords perspective so three of pentacles in reverse three of pentacles in reverse for it of pentacles in reverse yes yeah, somebody is manifesting now i think this king of wands is the one who's manifesting they know things are not working out between the two of you maybe they were in third parties whatever said and done that's not there anymore from what i feel because the three of pentacles is in reverse okay they are now wanting to come in and be the king of pentacles to this queen of pentacles somebody is manifesting this big time they know they have to make a choice though what's the choice what's the choice okay so if they had to make a choice spirit says they've made the choice this is a card of somebody having to make a choice this is a card of some, somebody has already chosen okay the choice is made they no longer in two minds should i do i want it don't i want it this person has already kind of made that choice they no longer split between what should i do what should i what do i want this person is ready to end this conflict in fact they want to now find peace with their partner no wonder this peaceful card was given by the angels somebody is looking for this now peaceful resolution to whatever happened here so but there is stagnancy at the moment yes knight of pentacles why is the knight of pentacles here because they feel the the stagnancy is because they feel their person has made another choice the person has chosen to shut the chapter down they don't love them anymore they're not clear about the other person's perspective or what they are thinking in their mind they feel this connection is already stagnated the love is lost and um, well my person has shut the chapter down on me what's the ace of uh, swords in reverse spirit ace of swords in reverse maybe 
maybe somebody lied here and maybe they kept secrets they made some unwise choices or decisions could have also had bad communication skills maybe they were rude or nasty or something somewhere they are confused they don't know as much as this person now wants this brand new beginning they want to offer this now they want to end this back and forth uh, king of wands say something the king, king of wands is back again second time so i'm going to give him the mic uh, cancer let's see what he wants to say king of uh, wands you have the mic now what would you like to say here king of wands what do you want to say to okay first and foremost okay one more They want to unbreak this Queen of Pentacles heart. That that is for sure. What this King of uh, Wands is wanting to say, I want to. I want if we could just drop this past baggage. Yes, there were there were some maybe some addictions or toxic behavior in the past. They want to talk about it. They want to reveal whatever secrets they were or whatever. They are very unhappy and feeling very loved with this no communication. They want to heal things with this. Uh, Queen of Pentacles, I think. I don't think this person wants to be a player anymore. I don't think so. They definitely want, don't want this chapter shut down between the two of you. So, Queen of Swords. Let's give the Queen of Swords on the mic as well, since the Queen of Swords also came out twice. Queen of Swords, what would you like to say here? Queen of Swords. <laughs> okay. Okay. Queen of Swords says, well, yes, I have walked away. I have walked away, but I'm open to communication. I have been waiting and they are really slow. They haven't made a move yet. I would be willing to listen. I'm willing to listen to them. In fact, in fact, I, I won't mind a reconciliation. <laughs> and uh, well, if they come back and speak the truth, I may be willing to forgive them or at least re reconcile with them. Yeah. There is a possibility of a peaceful resolution. I do see this King of Wands wanting to take action. I think very soon they will. Um, they are, they've made up their mind, that's for sure. Okay, that's all I have for you, Cancer. Till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste.